Okay, hello and welcome back to the Tempe Gamer channel. Um, we're having a go on crazy time today. We've got a £10 balance which we're going to use on this today. Um, and I'll just, just, just explain the strategy a little bit. Um, because the way I look at crazy time, um, and I know everyone's got different strategies here and there's, there's a lot of strategies based on number one not coming out and betting on all the other numbers um but i go for something a bit different because in my eyes crazy time although obviously sometimes you get some huge hits on crazy time itself um that was nearly a pachinko um typically it, when it does come out you, you know you can wait sometimes sort of four or five hundred spins for crazy time to come out and and typically when it does come out it's something 25 to 50x something like that um, sometimes worse, even there is a 10x on there, which I think probably shouldn't be on there. It's pretty outrageous. Um, so I don't bet on crazy time at all, and I and I just take the chance that you know that time's going to come when I'm going to place my bets, and crazy time's going to come out, and it's going to be absolutely huge, and I'm going to miss out on that. But I think with all the bets saved um, by not betting on it, that probably I make that up anyway. So I'm not too worried about crazy time. Won't be betting on that. Um, I think most of the money on this game is probably made on coin flip and uh, pachinko, which is where I've had all my biggest wins. But I'm happy to give cash on a try as well. Um, and we'll play through this £10 and, and we'll see how we do. See how we get on uh, with this strategy. I have absolutely no strategy for cash hunt. I actually usually leave this to auto pick, taking the risk along the way that it may well be rigged and, you know. <laughs> Well, that's what people say, um, but yeah, I, I just let this auto pick. I've tried, I've tried previously picking one square and going for it every single time. Three three was always where I used to go here. Three across, three down was always my strategy before, but it's not been successful. Uh, I, I find that I tend to get slightly better outcomes by just letting it auto play. See how it goes. It's gone to that position anyway. Oh, and it's a 7x. <laughs> it auto-picked my uh, my usual spot when I pick. So it's been learning from me. But ATP, I mean, it's an, it's an 8 times, so it's not too bad. Just having a little bit of a look at the history. I know I said, you know, you don't see crazy time in four or 500 spins sometimes, and there it is, twice in five spins, but that's quite unusual. Crazy time's one of those that people chase, and, and it really doesn't come out very often. Um, yeah, there's been a few pachinkos there and a few coin flips as well. Um, sorry, cash hunts as well. One coin flip. So yeah, it does look like it's been playing okay, actually. So I do place this double bet on number two as well. So when I when I do my bets, I, I, I always put 10p on the bonuses. When I'm doing a low stakes session like this, I'll place 10p on the bonuses. But I do put that extra tw the 20p on and the extra 10p on number two. Because I actually... It's, it's great for keeping your balance going if you're going for a longer session, which I typically tend to do. Um, the, some of the big wins come from number two, so two with a 25x and with a 50x, so you're looking at 10 and 20 pounds. So it's, it's actually it's, it's a pretty good square to be on, a section to be on, to be honest. Um, I think it's probably, you know, from all the sections on the board, probably the most um, consistent and the most profitable one on there. One with a 15x. I have bet on number one before. Um, and it's pretty good, to be honest, when you get the multipliers. Number one can be pretty good. Look, looks like it's going to come out as well. Yeah, one with a 15x. But I do just... I put my bet on number two instead these days. Cash on 3x would be pretty good. It's going way too fast, though, isn't it? It's going way too fast. And that's a coin flip, okay. I was talking about this bonus round the other day when we did our Well, Well, Well live game show um, video. And I kind of compared this to the Buckets of Gold, I think it's called on there. And I know people were saying that, you know, on, on Buckets of Gold, that the potential payout is a maximum 35x, which is a bit disappointing. Um, but if you look at coin flip as a comparison, because it's on the board a similar number of times... The pair on coin flips actually consistently quite low, so you know you quite often I've hit an eight x there, which is cool. Um, but you quite often hit two x, three x, and and if you compare that with buckets of gold on on the uh, well, well, well live game show wheel, um, I find that 
you know, typically on, on buckets of gold, you're hitting sort of 15 to 25x, really. It's, it's pretty consistent. So I kind of prefer that bonus, to be honest. I would say 95% of the time, coin flip is pretty awful. Another cash jump with a 3x. Is that too fast, or is that actually slowing down? This could happen. It's slowing down a bit too much, probably. Yeah, just slowed down. And it's a number two. Cash jump 3x could have been quite good. Seems to want something to come out with this cash hunt, but again, that is going way too fast to stop anywhere near cash hunt. Number five. Okay. Oh, that's looking like it might be somewhere close to crazy time. And if it comes out, this is where you've just got to look the other way. I think it's going to be a little bit short, luckily. It's going to hit number five or two. Number two, we'll take that. We'll take that. And we're sort of um, so maybe 10, 11 spins into this session now. 10 spins or so, and and we're still we're only £2 down, so it's, it's not too bad at the moment. And we haven't really hit anything too serious to boost our balance yet, which hopefully will happen. So it's not too bad so far. Yeah, you don't want that coming out. <laughs> you don't want that coming out on this strategy. No chance. Like I said, I, I have mentally prepared myself for the fact that that is going to happen at some point. It, it actually hasn't happened yet, and I've been playing Crazy Time for quite some time, and I haven't had that happen to me yet. Um, but yeah, it's, it's going to happen. It's just a question of time. But I'm quite happy not betting on it. It's, it's, I can't accept the disappointment of betting on Crazy Time for 400 spins, at, you know, costing £40 if you put 10p on it and getting £2.50 back. It's just, you know, for me, it's not, it's not acceptable. Two and a four X. I'll take that. That looks pretty good. Just going towards a section of twos over there. It's just got to hit one of them. If it could get past that coin flip, uh, I think it's stopping early. It's actually stopping on coin flip, is it? No, number one. See, that would have been 180, which would have been quite nice at this point. It's hard luck. Is that a coin flip? That looks like a yeah, coin flip, yeah. That slowed down pretty quick. I feel like the wheel's really tight today. Must be a recent change on the flapper. Let's see what we, yeah, 15x and a 3. This needs to be red. 3 isn't even your bet back on this. And it's the 15. It's a bit of a relief. After what I said earlier about coin flip typically being 2, 3x, 4x. It's now hitting the biggest side each time, you know, just to, just to prove me wrong. But I know what coin flip's like. But yeah, we needed that 15x. That's good. Two with a 2x. I mean, it will do. I think that's going to stop somewhere close. Maybe coin flip even. Oh, so number one again. Stuck between the coin flip and the two. It's a shame. Cash up with a 25x, good god. Well, that would be nice, wouldn't it? But it is absolutely nowhere near. Hopefully, it can stop near Pachinko. Ah, oh, it's just over. It's just over. Cash up 25x would have been absolutely insane on this. Um, even on this day, it would have been absolutely insane. I have actually hit a cash up 50x right when this game first came out, and it was, I think, June 2020 I, I first started playing this game. And I hit a cash hunt 50x, and it was a bit disappointing, to be honest. I did manage to hit a 500x, which sounds okay, but when there was other some 5,000s on there, you know, um, it was quite a disappointing outcome. the equivalent of hitting a, 10, a 10x without the multiplier, so I was a bit disappointed with that. Number one again. In my, my three or four biggest wins on Crazy Time since the game's come out, I've hit 2,000x on Pachinko twice, 
um, once on, I think it was Boxing Day 2021, um, I hit that one. Uh, and then I've hit some really big wins on, on coin flip as well. I've had a 625 and a couple of 500. So, so like I say, with coin flip, it, although it can be really disappointing, I've, I've hit some of my biggest wins on there as well. It's just so rare. Is that slowing down enough for a Pachinko? Potentially, potentially. Here we go, Pachinko. At last. And that has been a few spins since last night. Yeah. And it's not only maybe it's not only about an eight. Yeah, about thirty spins or so. I suppose that's actually on cube statistically. Let's see first. Maybe it will be like some hundred or two hundred X, yeah. If it will be like some huge multiplier on a You need a good build here. Thirty five and it's disappointing. It's a disappointing build. You need to hit double here. Oh, it's in the right place. Of all the places for it to stop on the board, I, this corner is about as good as it's going to get. Just need to avoid that 7x. Which is heading right towards... Oh, oh a 20x. We'll take a 20. That's pretty good. Considering that board, that is pretty good. Potentially a cash hunt. Well, I think that might slow down a little bit. I am not judging this wheel well today. Number two, we'll take that. That's fine. That's a little bit, a little bit of profit there on that spin. And we're now sort of 21 spins in now, and we've still got over half our balance left. And, and we're doing okay. And we've had a couple of bonus rounds, and I think with crazy time, that's pretty much what you're looking for. You need to be in the game as long as possible. Um, to try and, you know, cushion the blow of some of the spells like this when it's not as good. And see if you can get to a, you know, get to one of the spells where it picks up and you hit some top slot uh, multis on the bonus rounds, which is really where you need to get. I feel like that's got a chance. I hope it slows down. It's slowing down. It's slowing down. <laughs> God, that would have been devastating. Coin flip with a 5x. It's slowing down, isn't it? That's a shame. And that looks like a number two, which is okay. Obviously, would have preferred the coin flip there. Yeah, that point. Looks like a coin flip. Yep. Coin flip. Yeah, the 100x multiplier on coin flip is exceptionally rare. I just flipped the switch. Flip, flip. But I have had it a few times. I don't know nobody else is doing this. Come on. Yeah, it's quite a standard round. Now it's just a We've hit the highest one two times in a row, so... Oh, we've hit it again. That's actually pretty good. Coin flip's pretty good today. Anything over 5x on this strategy is profit, so that's that's where we need to stay. Somewhere around now. It's pretty good. Good luck. Now it's a coin flip with a 3x. Maybe now. Maybe right now. Coin flip. 3x multiplier. This would be good. Is it going to happen? Ah, oh, it's going to go over, I think. Yeah, it's just a little bit too quick. It was close. It was close. Responsibly. Responsible gaming is everything. That's a number 5. I feel like this number 5 has been doing really well since I started. It doesn't always, though. It's it's not a great bet, in my opinion. You very rarely get big top slots on number five. You get the 2x and the 3x on top of it, but it, I think the big top slots, the, the 20, 25s, and 50s, that t tend to happen on number two. And sometimes the bonuses, but obviously much more rarely. Yeah, it's been coming out quite good on number one. Is that slowing down towards coin flip? Again, it's just over. It's one with a 10x. That's come out a couple of times. Number one with a top slot. We've had one with a 15x as well. That's heading towards coin flip again. That sort of area. Slowing down much slower as it spins anti-clockwise than it is going the other way. It's really odd. Chinko 3x, and I, again, I think this is going to slow down somewhere just short of it again near <laughs> Queen Cliff. That there is like some trick in his nickname. Yeah, it was pretty funny actually. That's a number he one. Just before the Queen Cliff. There's one. been quite a few ones. If you look at that last 
Um, what have we got there for 21 spins? There's a fair number of ones in there. Just three bonuses. So a pretty tough spell right now. Five with a 5x. That's going to slow down nit number five, isn't it? I can. See. Yeah, yeah. I feel like we've been on the wrong number this session. It doesn't. Uh, it very rarely turns out like this, but it has hit every single t five top slot going. Which is cool. That's good for for anyone betting on number five. Uh, but it's not usually that good. It's in sessions like this that you've got to have the balance of numbers and bonuses. You can't just bet on bonuses because if you hit a spell like this, it's devastating. And that's a pachinko, so this we really need something here. Um, we're right down towards the end, so hopefully we can get some good multipliers on the board and pick something up. 200x would be very nice at this point, yep. There's a bunch of 7s over there, so hope to avoid all of those. 50 is 100 on there, yeah, this is a decent board. This is a decent board. I'd like to hit a double first, but I'll take 100 straight out. It's close enough. It goes off to the left. Let's go. Oh, it's going the wrong way. It wants to go the wrong way. Oh, it started going back. You need to go. Need to go right. Oh, we'll take a fifty. That's actually pretty good. That takes us back up to seven fifty. That'll do. We take those. And there's that number five again with a 3x. I'm not going to be changing my bet because I, I know what it's like on these sort of games. I change my bet to five, it'll all start coming out on number two. I'm pretty consistent. I've, I've got my strategy and I don't tend to deviate from it very often. Um, I've never really betted on number five because I just don't think it's worth betting on. But it's proven me wrong this session. Two with a 5x, yep, we'll take that. Slowing down. I actually think this might be a coin flip. Oh, it's gone way past it. Is it enough for the two? No, so number one again. See, these top slots, which are coming out on number two, or which are, you know, are coming out on the top slot for number two, they're all missing. And it's all about that. You know, if, if, those are, if every one of those had come out, um, we'd be in a slightly better position like it has on number five. But we've just been a bit unlucky with those top slots, so number two is actually killing us a little bit at the moment. Let's hope that turns around soon. Five with a top slot again, really? I feel like this is really close. This could happen. Oh, just before. Just before, good. That's what I like to see. I don't like to see the one, but... I don't want to keep hitting these top slots on five. What, happened there, Bob? Time for the new spin. what we haven't hit yet is a top slot on a Life on a bonus, which is exactly what is we need right now. This could be crazy time. time that looks good for crazy time. Still, uh, Slowing down. Yeah, that's a crazy time. Crazy so I'm just going to have to look the other way while this happens. <laughs> now, in times gone by when I've bet on crazy time, I always choose green on the, on the flappers. Um, so we'll Let's see go. what comes out on green. Let's see what I've missed. So we're 60. Uh, so sorry, we're 39 spins into this session. We started at 100 on here. So this has to be more than a 39x for me to um, have lost anything here. Well, 39x or more, obviously. Um, there is 25. If it hits a 50, then I would be slightly down, but not too worried. Um, but I'll be a little bit more disappointed if we start hitting doubles and or hundreds. We'll see how it goes. Mm, it's a 50x, so 25 on the two other flappers. So I'm effectively £1.10 down there but if I'd have been betting on crazy time. But I would also, my balance at this point would have been £1.60. So, um, yeah, it wouldn't have been a great position anyway. Welcome back, everyone, guys. Oh, is that time, racing that towards crazy seven. time again? Go, I, I think go, it might stop go, on the 10, go. you know. This stop could be it. Jump on that too. Oh, 10 with a 7x. So that's pretty good for anyone betting on that. That's already something, guys. The duel have a profitable session with all the mm, other players. Potential like coin flip. Here. It's going to be a coin flip. We'll take that. Okay. Let's have this 100x. Let's have the elusive 100x. 
or 50x, we would be quite happy with that as well. Everybody Take us back to our starting point and give us some more ammunition. Side on a coin. Come on, 100x. One okay, time. let's one see. Time, let's Come see. On. 12x, mm, 12 and 3. When's our luck going to run out on this? I don't want to curse it, but we have hit the biggest one every time. That's incredible. <laughs> that is incredible. Every time. And these aren't massive wins, but if you can consistently hit the highest one on coin flip, it is actually it's good for your balance. Crazy time with a 10x, and it's just on its way, isn't it? I think Let's it's going to slow it. down. I don't Ten think it's going to make it. Nah, that's slowing down. Thank God. Okay, there's a <laughs> that uh, was anyways. close. There might have been tears. Hopefully, th my name is Cha Cha. Clap, clap, Cha -cha -cha. It's going to be close. It's a number two. That's gonna be an average which again, we're happy with. We take number two. Right and 45 spins in. The balance is not looking too bad. We're anyways, doing okay. We we're just we're staying in the game. Okay, cash guys, hunt so three cash x, x and right yeah it's gonna go short you. unfortunately i thought that was gonna be closer but it really wasn't and that's, that's gonna five. be number five ladies and gentlemen so congratulations to you why i'm going home i feel like that's quite close <laughs> to crazy like, time again what does Hopefully it mean it this down. is not my vibe <laughs> There's gonna be a five with three X multiplier. It's next door. And, uh, and I told this to a very colleague. commonplace for the flapper to land uh, next to crazy there. time. So, and again, so quite pleased that didn't before, hit. So we're now before, down to three, or so it'll be two ninety in the second two eighty. Uh, so uh, we're coming towards so the end. Actually, not been too bad to be honest. If we look back at the history, um, you know, we've got a history there of forty nine spins or so, seven times forty nine, yeah, and. And we've had like, quite a few bonuses, so it's not been too bad a session, but I think we've just really missed out. The, the fives have stole the show, really, with all those top slots, this and that's what we've really vibe. missed. We've missed having those top slots on our wins. <laughs> on the first day, two, like, literally two, uh, two hours working. So you're like, mm. That looks like a number two, which isn't too bad. Like 18, and uh, because uh, those are teenagers and they're not like responsible enough. And of oh, course, Chinko 10x. Like now that really would have been good, but we're well, actually right? like I said, going well over that like and heading towards the number two or coin flip like around there. Workaholic or something like this. Mm, and number two, yeah. Lot, I would that's say. okay. That's going to be number two right there, so guys, congratulations to you, but it really depends. Uh, never. <laughs> I think we're probably heading towards that like, number two again, you know. So random, I mean. Yep. That's gonna be number, number two. two right there, so guys, congratulations to all we are perilously close to the end, though. <laughs> we are perilously close, I think. There's gonna be number two, guys. So I would be surprised if it's uh, if we're still playing well, in 10, 15 uh, spins Jet, time, but hopefully something can come out. We can get a, a top slot on one of these bonuses in these final spins. Two with a three X yeah, so would be quite nice. It's uh, going towards some number twos again. Communicating, uh, it could also be somewhere handy for Pachinko um, as well. So nah, it's gone media, over. Uh, Is that enough for number two? No, it's number ten. Because, like, that's where yeah, those works, right? those top slot twos that's have just we haven't 10, hit a single right? one. Congratulations quite unlucky. And, uh, you know, you get days where you where you hit every single one of those, but it's just not been our day today. Two with a three X again has given us a second chance. I don't, I don't, I don't think, think I think this it. might be heading into <laughs> a bit she, of a dead area to be honest. If it, we get over that cash hunt, uh, we've got a chance. Job on hand, right? Oh, I think that is it. Uh, there is going to be number two, everyone. Number two, two finally, with the top so slot. It's only 140, but it's a bit more on the balance. And, yeah, so basically my friend and hopefully left it'll then, change um, our luck a little bit. That's not too bad. Then, uh, for me, it's going to be the same, right? Be crazy time, 7x. So Obviously, as like much as I don't bet on Crazy like Time, um, and I've already almost? explained my reasons why for that, uh, crazy time I nice, also and, uh, I'm very 50-50 no with Cash Hunt, because I feel like it doesn't because really, like it, doesn't really like it doesn't offer you enough opportunity for how irregular <laughs> it is on the guys, board. It's only there twice, so it's 1 in 26 or so, 1 in 27, and I do very often hit... 10x, 5x, 7x on that right, bonus, and, and on the occasions when I've been lucky enough to be there when, this, when we've hit cash up with a 25x or a 50x, so I've never really hit like anything considerable on there. Like. So it's one of those which I put it there just in case, I think. I have a computer um, just in case like it comes out with a 50x and I miss right? it. Like, I don't want to be that person so you are for your um, own? on that particular bonus, but it's not great. 
two with a 15x. It's going to be close. It's going to be really close. It's probably going to go over it. Yeah. Just missed. That's unlucky because that would have been six pound and took us right back up to our starting balance almost. So... Yeah, like I said, we've been unlucky on those tops not number twos, and, and, there's 3, and that's why our balance there, is two pound at the moment. To See, I'm gonna stay here for a while because I really like this job, though, and it's just like a like a lovely rest. And we're on a pretty unlucky after, like, run at this point as well because we've been some like, sort of seven fourteen eighteen spins now like, since the last bonus, and in crazy like, time terms, that's pretty devastating off. for your balance. So that two with a thirty x would have been really important in a run like this. I mean, look I'll how many ones and twos there are in this, in this history. You really have to hit your two top slots in there. Near a Pachinko. I think it might just slow down even too much, maybe. Oh, okay. Maybe a Pachinko. Bonus! Yeah, okay, we'll take that. Everyone, a 100 or 200 X at this right point there. would be a, a bit of a game changer. That's and a, a lifesaver for sure. Uh, let's go for a Pachinko bonus game, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see what we got. Got to get the good multipliers here. No, Deck, oh, Pachinko does have sometimes some terrible boards. A couple of sevens 10, 50, there. 20, oh, again, it's not a great board. This is not the sort of board you want when you've got a pound left in your balance. This is a bit of a disaster. Just if it can so hit guys, that 35 now, it it's right above it, but it is next to a 5x, which would be devastating at this point. So 35 is a max multiplier. We could get some double. It's going to be really close. Oh, it's going the other way. And oh, that is it's going to be, be a 7. Oh, so close. It tried to come back across, but yeah, the 7x and that is might spell our defeat at this Good point. Luck. And we have uh, 6,000 winners right there. Oh, that was 5 with a 50x for a second. So your colleagues were talking about you, Alpha? Is that close to crazy time? Quite yeah, that's message. really close to crazy just, time. Just, uh, that's not what you want to see at this point in the game. Is it going to go over? No, it's back? crazy time. And okay, guys, it, so yeah, this is another time. one. You just go. you gotta look Let's away go, at this babes. point and pretend you can't see it, and just hope the green flapper doesn't land on anything do, do, too do, 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 too insane. Let's go. Although I always point out to myself at this point that if I was betting on crazy time, I wouldn't even be playing. I'd have lost by now because we would have had another forty odd spins where there was nothing. So yeah, that's what I tell myself anyway. Come on, let's just have your standard round, your 15x, 20x, just don't be anything massive, right? It's another 50x. Two 50x's on crazy time. I mean, I would have, yeah, I'd be a little bit up on crazy time if I was betting on it, but as I said, this is quite unusual. We've hit two crazy times in, in 65 spins, which is statistically, um, well, you know, guys, better than the odds you would expect. And, and they've been quite good as well, so... But like I said, unusual world. enough for me not to worry so about it. Crazy time with a 3x. It doesn't just want me to lose, it wants me to be completely destroyed. We've got enough for another spin, and then I'll probably have to do a... Because well, you've got two easy. choices here, and I think I know, I'm going like, to take option two. Maybe I which is, you have this last spin, um, and then you add a few things on... Um, double up the bet just just to clear out this like last bit because I don't want to bet with where I have so to miss one. Your, your so last spin car, and we really are hoping they're here. Changing this that doesn't work. They're changing that. It doesn't work. They changed uh, some other tool. It doesn't work as well. Two so with a three X. Like <laughs> many solutions would yeah. cause this, right? And they're just like it's, it's going to stop short probably. And that takes a lot of time. That's going to be two or three X multiplier. That's a shame because so, that would have been interesting way to boost this, our balance right? back up. But I do understand that, like, it didn't work on this time, so we have lost, lost this time. It can happen. Just gambling, you lose sometimes. And but we've had a really good session, and if we look back at this history, which shows most a fair few of our spins, we've had some bonuses. We've we've had some wins along the way, but we've just like I said, the top slots on this occasion. Um, we're, we're 
the problem. Imagine uh, next we didn't day, get enough of those on the two. A, um, if anyone else has got any other hit. strategies that they'd like me to try, um, do let me know. <laughs> I'm happy to give them a try. What's the issue here? Um, like I said, this is the strategy I typically use, but I know other people have got completely different strategies where I've they bet on everything close, except right? for number one, or you know, know or some people include number one in their bet in some way or other. So if you've got any ideas, post them in the comments. I'm happy to give them a try. Um, and see you next time. Thank you. Uh, that's going to be number 10.